Hi everyone, how are you all doing? I hope you guys are doing well. Welcome back to this channel and in this video we are going to talk about um, a Prashna reading, a Prashna request uh, that I got from one of the client. So basically her younger brother met with an accident uh, in Chandigarh and I clearly remember it was November 4th, 2.21 a.m. in the morning when she called me and uh, she wanted to know whether her brother is going to survive uh, because the accident was very massive, very major. So we put a prashna for her brother to see whether he's going to make through the accident. So the details, as I told you, it was 4th of November 2021. The timing is 2.21 a.m. And the city name is going to be Jammu because that is my place of residence. So whenever you try to make a prashna, uh, you have to put the place of birth as your city, like the reader's uh, city, right? So that is that. And because it was younger brother, so first of all, you can see how the third house is massively afflicted. It has Mercury, Mars, Sun and Moon. And if you know anything about Mars, it is a planet which can give fatal injuries and, you know, massive this blood loss and all of that. So we can see that something of that sort has happened with him. And now we wanted to see whether uh, the brother is going to make through this accident or not. So first we have to see whether a cure is happening or not, right? So we made the third house, first of all, the younger brother third house as the Lagna. And whenever you need to see the health of the, of the person that you are reading for, it is always good if the six, seven and eighth house um, is empty for most part or it has very less malefic influence because if there's like a lot of planets in here, it causes problems, all right? And then we see here that the sixth and the seventh house is empty. In the eighth, we have Rahu, so that is one, um, not a very good thing here. But regardless of that, this is one good um, thing here, all right? Then next, uh, if you want to see if somebody is going to be cured and if they are going to get out of the um, illness, so if the Lagna, the Lagna Lord are in the movable sign, that is one very good indication. And we here very clearly see that the Lagna is in the movable sign, so that is good. And we also have two benefits there being Mercury and Moon, which is again a plus sign. So if you have malefics there, it is not very good, but when you have benefits there, so that is a very good thing, right? And then we see where is the sixth Lord, because sixth house is the house of illness. So we see Jupiter here is again in a uh, in a movable sign, so which is again good. So, you know, sixth lord or sixth house being in movable shows that the recovery is going to be quick, right? So that is that. So that is another second uh, very good thing. And then the next thing that we need to see is how many benefits do we have in the Kendra and Trikon. So we have one, two, three, uh, three benefits in the Kendra and uh, in Trikon, that is one, five, nine, we we only have Mercury and Moon. We do not have anything in 5 and 9. So that is cool. And then we see uh, where is Lagnesh. So if your Lagnesh is strong, all right, so that is again a very good indication that you are going to sustain through it. So the Lagnesh being in the third house of willpower, this shows that he is going to survive out of this situation that is coming to his life through his own willpower, through his own will to live and that was exactly what happened with him as well so that was that and then we have to see if the lagna is making any itshal with the fifth lord right so here lagna being venus uh, and we have saturn so they are not making any itshal here but let's see if moon is making any itshal with them making uh, the nakata so moon um, and uh, Venus are in Itishal, you can see here very clearly, and then Moon and Saturn are also in Itishal. So Moon basically is making an Itishal of the Lagna and the Fifth Lord. So you see Sixth House is basically diseases and Fifth House is end of disease. And here we can see a very clear Itishal between Lagna and the Fifth House through moon right so that is again a very plus point and you know moon is again a planet or uh, is a fast moving planet so uh, this again shows that the recovery is going to be quick 
so that is again one very good indication here and then we'll see if the lagna is making um, any ithshal with the 10th or the 11th so that is also a very good thing so 10th house is basically your cooperation with the doctor and how the medicine is affecting you and 11th house is again you getting out of the hospital so here venus uh, first of all we'll see lagna ithshal with the 11th so we have venus and sun so venus being yeah so we have Hold on a second, let me, yeah, so we are, we see that the Lagnesh and the 11th Lord are in Ithshal and then, yeah, Lagna and the 10th is also have, making an Ithshal. So many positive aspects here shows that the Jataka is going to make through this situation and um, yeah, like he's going to be out of danger and the recovery is going to be quick recovery, which is very, very cool. He definitely went through... Um, a surgery all right mars here in the lagna definitely gave him a surgery but the good thing is that uh, the, the accident was not fatal and he made through it so yeah that was the prediction and that exactly what happened and i'm very happy we are really very very happy you know when things like that happen like when you know like somebody survives and all of that so it's always a good thing so yeah that was that um so yeah if you also want uh, to ask prashna from me uh, regarding career, finance, health, relationship, whatever, then my links are in the description and also let me know how did you like this video and I will see you very soon in the next one. You guys take care. Bye.